This post-match report is proudly brought to you by Complete Sports Management, More Footy, Less Admin and Stat Guru. When numbers matter. Hi, I'm Jordan for Complete Sports Management here at Shrams Reserve. We've got Connor and, Connor and Isaac, two players for Doncaster today, who played really well. Um, how do you think your game went today, Connor? Oh yeah, the boys did well. Um, yeah, we like we knew that there'd be a good lineup. St Mary's like top of the, the like second, I'm pretty sure. So we knew like them and Fitzroy are like the benchmark of the league. So yeah, we gave it like a good crack. Uh, got pretty close and. It's just probably like a 10 minute like fade in our game that like gave them the, the game pretty much. So, yeah. And Isaac? Uh, yeah, as well she said, it was just a 10 minute period where they kicked a couple in a row and we just didn't really get back from it. But yeah, I thought we went pretty well considering we had a few out. Um, yeah, so the game was pretty much won in the second quarter by St Mary's who won by four goals in the end. Um, how, what, do, what do you guys think they did differently in the second quarter to get on top of you? Well, just their spread from like the midfield was really good. Like they're using the wings and stuff, and hitting up their forwards like really well. It's hard to stop. And we saw Jordan come off with a blood rule. He looked a bit like Joel Selwood coming back on there um, in the third quarter. How do you have anything to say about him? How tough is he? Is he? Yeah, he's a, he's a tough kid. Uh, not much really hurts him. Like broke his collarbone last year, and I'm pretty sure he played in the grand final like three weeks later. So yeah, not much really phases him. So yeah, pretty yeah, tough. It's just a tough unit. And um, you've got you've got Surrey Park next week. How how do you think you'll go there? Yeah, I think it should be good. Um, hopefully, we get a couple more back, and yeah, it should be a real good game. Yeah. And so you've got a f you've had a few players out today. You only started with seventeen. Who are you most excited about getting back? Oh, probably Lee or Trent over there. Um, they're two of our better players, and yeah, it was really good to have them back. Yeah. So, so, yeah. We'll throw over to Sam, who's got St Mary's. Thanks for that. Sam Walker here from Complete Sports Management with coach of the winning team, St Mary's Kookaburras, Rob Bowson. Rob, what do you think of the game today? Oh, it was pretty scrappy uh, for us, from my point of view. Um, yeah, look, we won the game just, uh, got away with it, but from my point of view, probably not the way we wanted to play. So um, we've got a lot of work to do throughout the week so yeah. So hard training session for the boys this week uh, what are you going to focus on do you think oh, probably stoppage work I thought we got uh, yeah look we got beaten probably the last couple of weeks there and you know, it's, you know we, we pride on ourselves uh, pride ourselves on that but um, today we're pretty ordinary so um, I think uh, the boys probably come to the game expecting to win and uh, and I was a little bit afraid of that before the start of the game and certainly the, to the opposition's credit, they served it up to us. So, um, lucky to get away with it. Now, I noticed in the past couple of weeks, you, you haven't had that ball movement that you showed in the first, in those two big wins. Um, any reason as to why they might have stopped that? Oh, that's an easy question to answer. It's, it's the opposition. The opposition don't allow you to do that. So, um, again, today we expected to win the game, and that's the mentality of the boys. That's their mindset. And, um, you know, like I said, to the to the opposition's credit, they stopped us from moving the ball the way we want to. And it's as simple as that. And that's stuff we need to work on. And, um, you know, we've got Campbell next week, and um, we just got to work on it and, and see if we can rectify it. Hmm. Now, Lachlan Wilson kicked three goals for you. Was that... Was that good for you to kind of boost the team a bit? Oh, look, that, that was great for us, yeah. Look, he, he offered plenty of leads, and there was, he probably could have finished with five. Um, you know, sooner or later he's going to clunk them, and he, he just dropped two or three, which he probably sh should have stuck. But at the end of the day, he was probably one of our shining lights. So, um, yeah, to his credit, three out of eight. It's not a bad day. Mm. Now, as you said, you've got Campbell next week. What's going to be the focus going up against them? Well, again... Like I've said to you before, they're an unknown to me, so I don't really know. Um, we'll just take the opposition as they come, and uh, we just try and play our game. And uh, that's about it. That's all I can say. And we'll just work on it at training and see what happens next week. Mm. That's uh, Rob from uh, St Mary's Cookerows. Thank you very much, mate. No worries. And uh, good luck for next week. No worries. Good luck. This has been another Complete Sports Management production.